Today I'll be making this Coptic stitched wooden cover notebooks with the famous face of the Guy Fawkes mask. I made three of these with slightly different colors. The first step is to select the covers. I use pine plywood, A6 in size. I do stack cutting of three covers. Here I stick the first two together and then I add a third. I wrap the whole stack in masking tape. After the stack is wrapped, I stick on the pattern. Next, all the entry holes are drilled. Cutting is done on the scroll saw using a number 5 blade. This whole process takes about 40 minutes. I add the three back covers to the stack and keep it in place with masking tape. I then roll the holes that is used for binding later on. Then the stack is taken apart and the pattern removed. All six covers are sanded up to 400 grit. One cover is stained with a homemade stain of coffee vinegar and steel wool. The excess coffee is wiped off and I leave it to dry. I paint one cover with diluted white acrylic paint. This gives the cover a whitewash look. After everything has dried, I add four coats of glossy lacquer. At this stage the covers of the notebooks are completed. The next step is to make the signatures. I take three A4 pages, fold them in half and fold them in half again. This makes an A6 signature with 12 pages. I make nine signatures per book. This gives a total of 108 pages per book. I stack the signatures between two pieces of sacrificial wood and then I cut the sides on a scroll saw using a number 9 blade. I also cut the slits that will be used to bind the signatures later on. The front page of each book is painted black. This gives a really nice contrast when the book is closed. The thread for each book is measured out. Each thread is waxed with a piece of beeswax. With all the elements ready, it's time to start the Coptic stitching. I usually start stitching from the back and start with binding the last signature to the cover. The slits cut into the signatures lines up nicely with the holes drilled into the covers. Using slits rather than holes in the signatures makes the stitches sit a bit deeper on the spine. The whole process of binding one book takes approximately 50 minutes. At this point I'm halfway done with this book. The last signature and front cover is added at the same time. I find this to be the most difficult part of Coptic stitching.
The last step is to add the logo to the book. And the book is done.